Hi, I'm Miss Jean. Have you been to any weddings this year? Well, I haven't yet, but there's one that I've been thinking about. It's Jake's sister's wedding. Now, we haven't met Jake's sister yet. Her name is Olivia, by the way. But Jake has been so busy at the dinosaur dig. I'm wondering, did he forget all about the wedding? Well, I hear blue birdie flying. Maybe Jake didn't forget. Come on, let's find out in today's mini adventure called Forget Me Not, where Jake exercises his memory and his faith. That's a nice looking aircraft you have there. Thank you. Blue Birdie's a de Havilland beaver. You looking for some fuel? Yes, indeedy. You came to the right place. Good. Fill her up. I'm going to my sister's wedding. That's exciting. There's a restroom and a water fountain on the other side of the hangar. Freshen up a little while I fuel up Blue Birdie. Why, thanks. Oh, such a beautiful day for Olivia's wedding. Ah, there's the water fountain. Ah, what a perfect day to stop and smell the flowers. Oh, they smell wonderful. Blue Birdie is all ready for you. Why, thank you. Come on, Blue Birdie, Olivia's waiting. Jake! Jake! Olivia! Never fear, your favorite brother's here at last. <laughs> Jake, you're my only brother. Which makes me your favorite. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad that you made it. I thought that maybe you forgot. Forgot? Are you kidding? Of course not. Well, come on. There's only an hour until everyone arrives. Hand them over and I'll put them in some water. You, you'll put who in water? <laughs> Jake, don't tease me. You promised you'd bring me the flowers. The flowers? Jake, we talked about this weeks ago. I said I wanted forget-me-nots for my bouquet. Um, how many weeks ago? You know, it, it was it before Rich arrived and dinosaur fever started and the dig and... It's all right. I was going to remind you, but I didn't think that you'd forget. Olivia, I am so sorry I... Had... It's all right. I'm just really glad that you're here. Now, I'm going to go check and see if they have enough chairs set up in the tent for the guests. But your flowers... Are... I'll think of something. Okay. I can't believe I forgot Olivia's flowers. This is a wedding disaster. Oh, what will I do? Well, there are fields and trees. There's got to be flowers around here somewhere. I'll find them. Jake hiked energetically into the meadow next to where he parked Blue Birdie. There were lots of yellow dandelions, but no blue forget-me-nots. He hiked into the forest behind the meadow. No flowers there. Jake circled the big tent and the chairs that were set up for Olivia's wedding. There weren't any wildflowers growing anywhere. This is a disaster. Oh, if I were back in Discovery Mountain, I'd know just what to do. I'd ask Mr. Simon. Hey, Mr. Simon! George Simon speaking. Mr. Simon, it's Jake. Jake, how's the wedding? A disaster. Mr. Simon, my sister asked me to bring her flowers for the wedding, and I forgot. Oh, no. Mr. Simon, are there any forget-me-nots in Discovery Mountain? Yes, I can see some blue ones with pretty yellow centers in my yard. Oh, good. Mr. Simon caught me a bunch. Hop in, Blue Birdie. And you'll be here in time. Uh, Jake, there's just one problem with that. What is it? You have Blue Birdie. Well, of course I do. Mr. Simon, I just can't think straight. I've ruined Olivia's wedding. No, Jake, she'll think of something. Brides are resourceful. Oh, here she comes. Gotta go, Mr. Simon. All right, Jake, I'll say a prayer for you. Hey, Jake. Olivia, I looked everywhere. There are no flowers. It's all right. I found some. The work. Oh, good. Hey, they look pretty nice. Let me smell them. <laughs> Olivia! <laughs> what? They're not real. They're plastic. This is a wedding disaster. Jake, 
what really matters is that I'm marrying the man I love, and I have my friends and family with me. Liddy, you're so calm. <laughs> well, someone in this family has to be. Uh, you're a mess from hiking around looking for flowers. There's a restroom and bottled water in the house. Freshen up a little while I finish getting ready. Freshen up a little? Water? Olivia, I remember. I'll be right back. I've got a mission to complete. Jake? Jake? Oh, man. I tried to have a quiet, simple wedding, and in this family, nothing is ever quiet or simple. Jake and Blue Birdie flew back to the hangar where they'd fueled up earlier. Jake explained his mission to the attendant, and with a smile, they both rushed towards the other side of the hangar. In two minutes and 47 seconds, Jake was back in Blue Birdie. Olivia! Olivia? Oh no, they can't start without me. Jacob P. Donovan to the rescue! Just wait another few minutes. We can't begin until my brother Jake is back. Olivia! Olivia! Jake, you're back. Good. We're about to begin. Olivia, I found them. Here. Forget me nots. Jake, where? How? Oh, they're beautiful. At the place where I fueled Blue Birdie. They're perfect. Livy, I'm so sorry I let you down. You're my sister. I never want to forget what's important to you. Jake, it's all okay now. Go in the tent and sit down. I'm about to get married. Hey, what if I walk you down the aisle? I mean, I'm here already, so... That's Dad's job. Now go sit down. Okay. Oh, and Jake? Yeah? Thanks for coming to my rescue. You're welcome, Livy. Jake remembered just in time that the flowers at the fuel stop were blue with yellow centers, forget-me-nots. I'm glad that Jake remembered and that Olivia had her favorite flowers for her bouquet. I liked meeting Olivia. How about you? Maybe she'll visit Discovery Mountain one day. I'd like to get to know her better. Well, Jake felt terrible that he forgot something so important to his sister. I think that he'll try harder to remember in the future. And there's something that I never want to forget, and that's how wonderful God is to me and all that He does for me. Is that something that you always want to remember too? There's a beautiful verse in the Psalms that helps us to exercise our faith and our memory. Psalm 77 and verse 11 says this, I will remember the works of the Lord. Surely I will remember your wonders of old. Have you forgotten all the good things that God has done for you? Well, stop and remember all of His works, and you can't help but exercise your faith. And just like God helped Jake to remember, He'll remind us whenever we ask about all the good things that He's done for us. Well, join us next time for season 10 called Oshkosh or Bust, where our Discovery Mountain Pathfinders get ready for their trip to Camboree. I'm Miss Jean, and you've been listening to a mini adventure in Discovery Mountain where the air is clear, clear enough to hear your imagination, and where every day is an exercise in faith. Visit us at discoverymountain.com and connect with us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. 